once again, ladies and gentlemen. I am right back again with the another Let's Play of Ogre Battle 64, Person of Loaded Caliber. We go ahead and run back right back into there. As I said, I'm going to um, work on some of the controls here. Um, so right off the bat, uh, in a battle, you see Interrupt Command. You can add uh, Battle Strategy, which is Anonymous um, Battle Strategy. You'll attack Your guys will attack whatever. Um, strongest, they'll attack the strongest if they can attack the target. Um, I'll have to go into battle formation as well. Um, le attack leader, so they'll attack the leader if available. Um, attack the weakest, they'll attack the one with the least amount of health. I usually go attack leader because once you attack the leader, they sort of lose all control of their unit. And it makes it easier to pick them off. So as you can see, um, let's take the berserker in front, Troy. Um, he can attack anywhere except for b behind people, obviously, because there's a person in the way. Um... With that note, his alignment's going up. I don't need your alignment going up. Uh, anyway, um, with that, uh, he can attack anyone. If, say, the corner guy can attack the middle and the left-hand side. Actually, you know what? I'm going to leave Troy for right now. I think there's a knight up there, so Troy's going to settle down. Uh, you're going to get some positive alignment here. I'm already going to make a good uh, note of this. Um... So yeah, on that uh, note, um, characters with magic usually will attack either the middle bracket or the back bracket, and they can attack the same thing. They can attack, um, say, in the middle square, or left and right. If they're on the right-hand side, they can attack um, middle, back middle, and back uh, right. If they're in the middle, they can attack back middle, back right, back left. If they're in the back left, obviously, they can attack back left, back, back middle. Um... Yeah, and it's, uh, they can't attack the front roll unless the front roll is the only thing still existing. Um, on that note as well, uh, I need... Actually, I kind of need... I don't want Adam... Yeah, Adam's not getting in there. Good. I don't want Adam getting in there because I want him to get negative alignment. Um, liberated key for perfect. Uh, before you do that... Scriffly staff, yes. Spellbook. Robe which is dress, because I would like to get a witch. They are kind of a useless unit, but they can be kind of powerful. On that note, I need more heal leaves. Maybe six of them. And 80. Jeez. Put one on you. Alrighty, and some of the other uh, in-game options right here. Or no, that's battle animations. Um, with the uh, left trigger, you can choose the battle animations, which basically gets rid of the animation uh, of the character moving up and attacking. Um, I like to keep it on for some things. I like to keep it um, off if you want to sort of speed through and don't really care about the nostalgia of the game. Then, by all means, go right ahead. Um, again, with the interruption command, uh, the A button. Um, there's also retreat. Once the If you see in the top right corner where on the left-hand side of my units, you'll see the sword there. Um, every time that bar fills, uh, a little option will be given. Um, you gain a, a little bit of the bar from attacking units. I'm going to go ahead and keep attacking. Uh, attacking units, and you gain uh, much of it from um, taking damage. And as you can see, the second light has lit up there, which is retreat. So you can retreat at a certain time if you're taking too much uh, losses or your guy's getting too low on HP. And then the last one is your emblem. You don't usually get to use those really early on, sadly. Unless you're towards, like, a boss fight. Um, and when you get to use that, you get to use your element, and it will do sort of a bonus amount of damage. It's sort of a thing that only you can do. Um, the enemies don't have them. I believe some bosses look like they have them, but it's not actually part of their attack pattern, or it is part of their attack pattern. Um, other than that, um, there isn't other much more battle options there, or if the in-game variety at least. Up command, yep. There's that. Alignment down. Yeah, that just randomly went. Golems, I don't think have any alignment whatsoever. Most are neutral or negative. So you go Dio. I may actually have to keep him back altogether for this. Let's get going. I'm going to let Dio finish this guy and then I'm going to keep moving Leah up just because I want her to level up a bit better. I didn't set my timer so this one's going to be a little bit longer. Not by much I hope. Shink. Shink. 
As you can see, um, I think I've already mentioned this, but I'm going to go ahead and mention it again. Uh, golems have a high physical resistance, but they're really weak towards magic, so... And they deal out a decent amount of damage. They get to attack three times. Uh, they do physical damage, so against, like, heavier defense units, they don't do as much. But still, they'll do a bit more than, say, an average unit. Oh, I didn't want to kick you over by the bridge. Is your leader dead? Yeah. I'll go ahead and move him over here. Let's see if I can actually move this. I think he's just going to go for the stronghold, but I want to try and move him past that wizard. If he, if the wizard starts chasing after Troy, I'm going to back him off. There we go. Ah. What slash? With this dragon, I think it's Tryon, so I want... I think she wanted to be something like a Flare Brass, so I think it's a Fire Dragon, so I want to go ahead and upgrade that, just because I figured she'd like that. Um, yeah, this is going to be a high alignment unit, so I'm going to try and get um, uh, some pretty high alignment units in here. Ooh, a Rapier. Because the Fencer, uh, to become a Swordmaster, you need a ridiculous amount of attack power. I think Dex... No, not Dexterity. Um, high amount of attack power and what was that other? St I don't think it has actually has an additional stat to it, but a high amount of attack power and decent alignment. It's got to be in the positive. Now, this team is a little ineffective because of the fighter in the back there. He is um, he only gets to attack once there, but really the trade off would have been the dragon because with um, with critters. They take up two spaces, and you can't put anything beside them, behind them, or, say, on uh, the adjacent to them. So they can be a bit of a pain in the ass to work with, but they can be definitely worthwhile. Because they do hit hard, they do have additional, a lot more stats than regular units. But towards the end, they do kind of phase out. Let's see. Yeah, that's a high population and a decent morale, so I should liberate that. Should liberate that. Oh, we got a scene here. Don't think you can keep us down. We will not succumb for our kingdom, for our freedom. And the transition just went fruity. That's <laughs> just fine. I mean, if if the if the like animations weren't there for like the units and stuff like that, I'd be a little bit pissy about it. But this is this is fine. Also, in some um, in some higher levels, they will um, they will be a bit more of a pain when you conquer places. Sometimes bridges will explode and you'll lose areas, or enemies will just spawn out of the blue and start coming for that area. So, you do got to be a little bit careful with it. Sometimes you can get royally screwed over. I've had it happen to me, and I've just been like, oh, pulling out my hair, being like, God damn it, how can this happen? This is mostly an opportune time. Let shop. Ah, oh, just short. Alignment up, because I am attacking sorcerers or sorceresses and wizards. My alignment is going up. I'm gonna go ahead and wipe him off the map. Let Troy let's go up there. I th think I'm gonna let. Yeah, I'm gonna let Troy do the uh, Troy do the final battle with the boss, just because. I know Troy would like to eat a Valkyrie. I think she has, like, soldiers. And he hates children. So beautiful in that fact. Just keep wailing on it. 16 XP, 16, 16, 12. Not bad. They will get a lot less because they are higher level. But, say lovey. But also, I don't want you doing this. Bone Hill. Not bad. It's a decent item. 
up and go ahead and kill the wizard because I don't want him being alive anymore. He's just getting in my way. Less bank. Chomp. <laughs> oh, I love the animations when they die. Just uh, <laughs> it's so satisfying. I know I should be like, oh yeah, murder, love it. Gotta have at least three cups of murder a day. At least three cups of murder away keeps insanity away. Yeah, liberating. Hooray. At one point, I was, like, saving state every, like, five minutes so I wouldn't capture places. I got really anal about my chaos frame, and it really didn't help. Because I turned around, and I got a gola, uh, an ogre. I was like, get an ogre. And I was like, wait, that botches my fucking chaos frame. I was like, oh, no. And I was like, skip. Whatever. Ogres are awesome. Put them in my main group, and I was like, yeah, I'm Satan. Get over it. There's gonna be some free children running around. Alignment up. I think I'm gonna make Leah's group be light alignment. I usually always do. I never really. I don't actually think I've ever seen anybody not have her even be high alignment. I was speaking of which. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and rest just before he comes over and kicks me in the teeth. A good thing when you're defending is point him in a certain direction. I'm actually just going to go attack the strongest just because I want this guy to keep coming back and try to fight me. I don't really care if the warriors don't get a good hit off. I have healing items in case Troy starts botching it. And he's, oddly enough, Troy has a really good block rate. Mind you, you can't block a dragon biting off your leg. You can in Skyrim, but that's kind of broken. Whoosh, whoosh, da, everything. Whoosh, whoosh, da, everything. What does Lucy have on her anyway? Let's see. Oh, I hate Grim. Especially when they're in the middle. I hit them in the back more because they make you fall asleep, but that frickin' debuff grinds my gears. Hopefully he doesn't hit anybody important. Like the little soldiers. Hey, kitty. God, you're a fat kitty. You weigh like 40 pounds. Don't hit Troy. Okay, go. Those guys don't get attacked again, so no big deal. <clears throat> oh, man. So raspy. It's beautiful. I don't think for any reason that she'd be able to hit me for 50 or up to 54, so I'm going to leave Troy just sort of sitting with his health, as is. And now Leah's going to go and finish this guy off and wipe out that child. Dude's like, I don't want to be here. They said I could have cake and they lied. <laughs> oh, I'm evil. Da -da -da -da. And that music makes you feel so good when you lose. The bad music, it's like da na, da na, da na, 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 na. And you're like, oh man, I feel like a failure. My life. Where are you going? We're ready to kick some ass. Okay, the warriors, the knight over there is not going to get to attack, so, again, so, I, yeah, I'm going to have to heal after this, though. Don't put your alignment up, dude, you're supposed to be evil. God, go, like, ugh. what was it, in Fable 2, you eat those chickens? Go eat, like, 40 of those chickens and gain, like, 850 pounds. <laughs> oh, I remember doing that early game. Get that freaking sickle from the uh, demon door in Fable 1. But, uh, oh my god, I was fat for so long. 
just like did nothing but run for days. Now he's heading back to base, he will partially gain uh, stamina back and stuff like that, so it becomes a bit of a pain when they go back there. I won't save him though, because now he's up front. Might keep him alive for another round, however. I'm going to see if I can't attack the weakest and get rid of that dragon early on. Guard. When it's in the back, it gains a uh, pass or partial AoE. Ten. Ah, oh, balls. You failed me. Oh, hey, she became an Amazon. Yeah, see, right there, the Ascent Cross. Um, yeah, having that will uh, make Amazons, which is nice because I Troy needs some waves. He really does. He needs some women to keep him company. Oh, actually, I don't want to capture that. I'm going straight for you. Because he'll try and go back here as opposed to the base camp. Or he's just going to sort of float there in limbo. If I were to capture that, he would run back there. Go get him, Troy. Actually, you know what? I'm going to one-hit that guy, so... Or not one-hit, because my health will... Maybe my stamina will be low, but whatever. I'll get him. He's got two HP anyway. And I hit for ten. Look at that. Or Troy has for ten. There we go. Alignment down and level up. I gotta put the halt hammer on him. That's what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. I need you to do that. Breastplate. I'm gonna put one of those on Troy. He'd look good in it. Dude, you look awesome in that breastplate. Okay, well that's the end of that. Uh... Ooh, I gotta pause there. So that's the end of this Let's Play. Um, thank you ladies and gentlemen once again for watching. And I'm probably not gonna do another one today. I'm gonna head to bed because it's like freaking two o'clock and I know uh, what kind of gamer doesn't stay up to at least 7 30 in the morning but uh, I'm getting kind of sick so I'm gonna go ahead and call it quite early so uh, don't hate me forever um, thank you ladies and gentlemen once again for watching and I hope you enjoy the rest of your nights as well thank you and goodbye